Welcome back to another video. My name is Darren Cabral and I'm the CEO of Suit Social, a digital advertising agency that helps companies build their brand, generate more leads and get more sales online. And today we're talking about how to get higher quality leads that actually respond to you, that actually pick up the phone and buy shit. Whether we bleep that out or not, I don't know. Probably not. It's true. If you're a business owner, you don't want just a click or a lead or someone that just comes through and gives you an email. You ultimately want a customer that's gonna buy something, that's gonna spend money. So how do we get that to actually happen? Because if you've ever run ads in the past, especially if it's your first time or you don't really have an experienced team running them, you've probably run into an issue where you've run Facebook lead ads or Google lead ads and you get leads, but they never actually pick up their phone. They never respond to an email. They don't respond to a text. They just kind of ghost you. And you're like, well, what the heck? Or they answer their phone and they don't even know why you're calling them, right? How do we fix that? Because you're not alone. That's something that a lot of businesses actually have to deal with and that has to be addressed. And there's a reason why that's happening and there's a way to fix it. So the reason why that's happening is the leads you're getting typically are too cold. So you're putting out some sort of ad that has a call to action and that's about it. You're saying, here's who I am, here's what we do, buy something from me or click below, learn more, or click below to book a call. And then people just do it because it's easy to do. They click a button, they don't even know what they're signing up for and they never actually follow through. It's because they don't actually have intent. That's what's missing. There's not a deep level of intent. They haven't been thinking about your company. They don't really understand what you do. They don't really understand what problem you're solving or what they need. They're just kind of clicking something on impulse because maybe it was interesting. Maybe they kind of thought about it, but that's about it, right? And by the time the call actually comes around or the time you actually follow up or email them, they've probably forgot about you. The way that we fix that is instead of just running ads, like straight lead gen ads, like, hey, here's my offer, is you build an advertising funnel. We've actually called this funnel acquisition branding, and that's a system and a strategy, a way that we build advertising funnels that is a specific kind of step-by-step -step process that we've tested and proven over the last seven years to fix that issue. And the way that we do that is this. I'm gonna break it down really simply. So our acquisition branding strategy, which fixes this issue, has three steps. Awareness, lead acquisition, and the lead nurture stage. What this is, is at every step, we run different types of ads to attract attention at the top of our funnel and then nurture people slowly down to the bottom. So by the time they actually opt in as a lead for something, they know quite a bit about us. They've engaged quite a bit. They've received quite a bit of information and they're not going to be coming in cold. And so I'm going to give you an example of that. So in our acquisition branding system, like I said, it has awareness, lead acquisition, lead nurture. So at the top of that funnel, we have our awareness ads. That's what we run first. These could be just high value videos. It could be educational. Usually I'll tell clients, like think of the top five or six problems that your clients have, or your customers will have, or the things that they need solved, or the, the questions they ask you, and make videos around that. And get that out in front of as many of that perfect customers possible and just get them consuming the content, kind of like what you're watching here. Once they've done that, we can actually track that in our advertising and figure out who's watching what videos and how much of them. Then we can move to our lead acquisition uh, phase where we'll retarget all the customers that watch those videos, that engage with our brand, that visit our website, we'll retarget them and make them an offer. It could be a special offer, a coupon. It could be, um, you know, just a lead magnet. Like maybe you're an HVAC company. It could be like 10 ways you're losing money because of your old air conditioning system, right? And they'll download this little checklist and PDF and they'll give us their email and we'll know, okay, these people are serious. They're watching our videos. They're downloading our resources. They're actually needing something here, right? They're, they're gonna understand what we are, what we do, and they probably have a real problem. In the last stage, lead nurture, we're retargeting all of those leads and we're starting to nurture them with social proof. So we're showing them reviews or showing them case studies. And this is all happening with paid advertising, right? So we're running awareness, lead acquisition and lead nurture campaigns all at the same time. It's all different kinds of ads, but it's bringing people down this funnel if you can kind of picture that, right? And so what that's effectively doing is warming people up. So by the time, like, let's just say this whole example is for an HVAC company. By the time they've watched your videos of, you know, five ways to, you know, cool their house more efficiently, downloaded their list about how they can save hundred dollars a month by making X, Y, Z change. And then finally, they're seeing all these testimonials from your customers and recent projects you've done and before and afters, they finally decide to click through and come in as a lead. They're committed. They know who you are. They know what you do. You know, they already have a problem. These leads are going to pick up the phone. They're going to be ready to buy stuff, right? because you built them through this funnel. All the time wasters, all the people that weren't serious, they dropped off along the way. And so that's really the big value of building a funnel. And that's how as a service company, you actually generate leads that buy shit. You focus on building a funnel, a system, 
that's building your brand, that's attracting these leads, that's nurturing them over time, not just making a quick sale, not just getting a quick engagement. That's how you fix that problem. And we do that here at Suit Social with our acquisition branding strategy. We've done it with hundreds of companies and it works really, really well. If you wanna check it out, you could actually check the links in the show notes in the description, or you can go to suitsocial.com and you'll find a whole breakdown there that explains exactly how we do what we do, our entire advertising process, our acquisition branding system. It's all there for you guys, but if not, give it a go. Hopefully this helps. Think through it. Next time you think about advertising, think advertising funnel, not just an ad, and you can actually start selling shit to your leads that come through. I'll see you on the next episode.